Hey what's up everybody I hope you all are doing absolutely fine this is Rudra Ditte and in this video I am going to talk about a new update of OnePlus 9R which is the Oxygen OS 11.2.4.4 well if you are in hurry like me then you can download this update straight away from an application called Oxygen Updater application I will drop the link in the description box from where you can download this app. Well, if you see the app size, then it's 2.91 GB. It means close to 3 GB, but still I'm going to download this to check that if this update is stable or not. And also I would recommend you to wait for my review video of this update in which I can tell you that how good this update is. Well, now let's download this update and let's see that what new improvements and what new features we got here with this update. Alright guys now my update is downloaded and now if you guys are wondering like if you are using this app for the first time and if you are wondering that how to install this update then it's a very easy process just watch this carefully you have to go into the system and then you have to go in system updates then tap on this gear icon which is on the top right then you have to pick local upgrade make sure that you will choose local upgrade and once you click local upgrade you will see a file of 3 gb of course with the name of oneplus 9r oxygen in the front and just you have to tap on that and then you have to click install now and yeah now you are good to go all right guys so now as you can see the installation part is done now all the things you have to do is to reboot to your phone and after that your phone will update it to the latest ota version all right so now all the process is completed and now if you go to about phone and then if you see the update then you can clearly see that your phone is updated to the latest OTA version now let's see all the change logs and let's see that what improvements this update brings here to the oneplus 9r all right now if you see the change log then there are basically two change log one is system the other one is ambient display in system you will get plenty of you know change log first they optimize the overheating control management of third party applications they optimize the experience of quick reply in some scenarios and also you will get the security patch of july although it's the end of this month but i'm glad that they did i mean they did provide us the july security patch and then there are some fixes now the main update is the ambient display now there are you know some bitmoji uh, customization and also now you can take the screenshot of your always on display let me show you first the bitmoji the new feature which they provided here in this update all right guys first thing first to get the bitmoji aod you have to download this application i will drop the link in the description box of this application as well now after sign up it looks something like this you can download any stickers according to your liking and then you just have to go into the settings and then go into the customization and there you will see clock on ambient display and then you can see bitmoji you have to select that and then it will take some time to download this peak sticker and then you can see that it appears something like that i mean you have to take a selfie in bitmoji application and then it will create your avatar which looks something like you in some ways you so you know you can actually use that bitmoji sticker as your always on display and it will change automatically according to your time according to the scenario like uh, right now i am sitting on a mushroom reading book but after some time you know it will change automatically and now as you can see my you know bitmoji sticker is changed so yeah it will change according to uh, the time and scenarios now i have oneplus not ce as well with the 9r and always on display is on on both the phones now you can see i I am not able to take the screenshot in the previous updates but now in this update I can actually take the screenshot of always on display and then you can or either I can share the always on display screenshot with my friends so yeah that's that's good I mean that's cool all right guys so this is not a huge update where you know the oxygen OS changes to color OS or there are not any improvements on battery or camera especially there is no change log of camera so it's overall it's a you know light update but still uh, I don't know that if it is buggy or it's stable so for that you have to wait for my review video and if you enjoyed what you watched then definitely smash the like button and also oneplus nord 2 versus oneplus 9 r contents are coming very soon I mean especially the first video is going to be the camera comparison of both the phones so make sure to subscribe the channel for that and also tap that bell icon on so that you will get all the notifications of my videos but yeah guys that's been it from today's video i will see you very soon in my next video until then bye bye take care